So you're supposed to submerge your faces in there for mm -hmm. 30 seconds straight. What? <laughs> So today we are gonna try a Korean beauty hack, Jamsu. That's supposed to make your makeup last longer. It involves ice cold water and baby powder. I'm trying to imagine how those two things can come together, I'm not quite sure. So first we're gonna cover our face with concealer and foundation, and then we're just gonna take a thing of baby powder, like just have it ejaculate all over our face. What is baby powder used for? Just like diaper rash? And then we're gonna dip it in water, and then we're gonna be beautiful. Maybe it's like you do your makeup in the morning, you put some ice cold water, you don't even need coffee. You're just like <laughs> Man, I hope it works. I mean, I'm always in the market for a smooth matte look. I'm concerned about the baby powder. I think it's going to shine through as being ashy and white. I have so many concerns. I feel like ice cold water is good for your skin, but it's going to be terrible for my mood. All right, let's do it. Let's dive right in. Let's go for it. I'm gonna start off with some primer. My face looks like I've been at a funeral. I typically start off with my brows and my eye makeup, but Same. for the purpose of this hack, we're gonna start off with concealer and foundation. I'm a yeah. little worried that this baby powder thing is gonna feel super heavy. So we've done our foundation and concealer. Baby powder is supposed to seal in our makeup, so we're gonna cover our faces with it. You're just supposed to try and make sure it's as even as possible. Do I just use my normal powder brush for this? How are we supposed to get that much baby powder on our faces? Yeah, fuck it. No, okay, no! Ah! If you have dry skin, this is not the thing for you. Oh, it's like snow or dandruff. I never thought I would say this, but I'm ready for the ice water. You can take breaks as needed. Take breaks? <laughs> Three zero. You did not tell 30 us 30 whole Freddy. Christian seconds. Mine has more floating ice chunks than yours. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even think I can hold my breath for 30 seconds. One. No. Two. two. Oh! Are you gonna say three? Done. Doug. Ah! <laughs> Why? It's too cold. This is like in Titanic. I don't want to be in the water. I want to be on the door. It's actually, it's painful. I'm crying. Oh my God, my head hurts. I'm catching pneumonia. I can feel it. Imagine the worst head freeze you've ever gotten. And then imagine it's on the same day as the first day of your period. Nope. I'm done. I don't know what I hate more, the fact that we did this or the fact that our face looks good afterwards. Face looks pretty good. Oh, fuck me. Could this possibly keep our makeup on our face rather than just completely removing it? I'm distraught. Okay, well, I will say this did give me a runny nose. I feel like my skin was like really tired and upset with me and then now it's kind of like, Hello. Yes, I was just gonna say that. Your skin actually looks nice though. I'm gonna say like, I think your complexion looks like really matte and really even. <laughs> All right, well, I'm not mad at it, folks. Yeah, your skin looks really glowy and beautiful. Like, I think because you have smaller pores, like, this definitely worked for you. I'm pleased. I'm confused. It feels like there's just like a, a very thin film on my face. It definitely feels like it's gonna be matte for a long time. I think that like my cheeks and my forehead look good. Yeah. It's just my nose. I look like I have like a bunch of really tan freckles on my nose. I'm super impressed with how seamlessly the baby powder came off of my face after dunking. While this was fun, it's not over. We have three challenges to put our faces through throughout this day to see if it holds up. Challenge one, it's raining outside today. It is. So if this can withstand the rain, it gets a nice little check mark. Challenge number two is going to be the clothing challenge. We're gonna see if our makeup will smudge off on other people's clothes or our own clothes. And challenge three, at the end of the day, we're gonna take blotting papers and see how oily we are. Any challenge passed is a win. All right, let's do it. I'm just kind of like walking around in the rain. It's kind of refreshing, but um, we'll see if my makeup moves or does not move. For some reason, it seems like every raindrop is like avoiding my face all of a sudden, which I think is a win. I just came in from the rain and it still looks good. The hair's a mess, yeah. but, but no, the, I mean, I don't see any runnage. I don't see... Mm -hmm. No, it's pretty, pretty solid. Doesn't seem like any came off on the collar, so that's pretty boss. I actually don't feel as oily as I usually do. I think that at this time, usually my makeup would be much shinier, but I don't think I'm completely matte, but I do think it's helping. So I've literally been running around campus like a crazy woman enough to start sweating. I think way more makeup would have come off if I hadn't done this Korean beauty hack. It is just a little bit kind of foundation toned and a little oily. Oh yeah. 
So this is just a little bit of tapping on my forehead. You can see, you can see the makeup and the oil. I'm pretty greasy. I'm pretty well greased. Typically around this time, my eye makeup starts like bleeding onto like my cheekbone a little bit and it's not doing that at all. I wish this trick didn't work as well as it did. It's hard to tell if that's foundation or bronzer. The bronzer was not in the baby powder, ice cold water situation, so there were no promises made about the bronzer. But it looks like there's a little bit of foundation mixed in. The hack doesn't necessarily omit any possibility of smudging. I think that's inevitable at the end of the day, but it really gave me a soft, matte, smooth looking face the entire day. Jamsu. Thank you. We sealed our makeup with baby powder and by sticking our faces in cold water. It actually made us look pretty good. By the end of the day, usually I'm like quite shiny. And I was like, okay. It was painful to do. You had baby powder everywhere. Everywhere. When you took off your bra on Friday night, was it just like sprinkling baby powder? Everywhere. I was pretty doubtful of this hack. I was very pleased with the length of time in which my makeup lasted and I was displeased with just the process. <laughs> when it looked good when we first did it, I think it probably had more to do with the fact that it was just water on our faces and it just perked up our faces like little face bras. If I'm gonna get a head freeze, it might as well be because I've just polished off a lot of ice cream. Would do this again for like an event, maybe? Maybe. Perhaps. Lady tested. Lady no. No. Lady, why? No, lady, why? Lady, why? Lady, why are you doing this? Don't do that. Don't do this. 